YouTubers, it's Audra. Okay, so I um, just walked in the door. I went to the mall today and got a few things, so I'm going to share them with you. Um, yeah. So I went to um, Bath and Body Works as well. I'm gonna show you that stuff first. And I'm just gonna throw this out there. Judge me how you want, okay? I am weird. And I use body wash in a ridiculous fashion. Um, and I go through one every couple of weeks or so. And that's the old ones. I don't know about the new ones. So if you don't know, Bath and Body Works has changed their body splashes. And they're supposed to have less alcohol and more fragrance to them. Which kind of doesn't really excite me because I use them for the alcohol that's in them. I don't know, if you really want to know why, just send me a message and I'll explain it to you. But it's ridiculous and I'm not going to spend time explaining it because most people are like, you're ridiculous and don't care. So this is what I got. And I had a, They were having a sale, buy three, get two free. And then I had a coupon for 20% off my entire purchase. And then I had another coupon for free um, pocket antibacterial. So I got one in um, whatever that flavor is. Japanese cherry blossom. I just grabbed one because I was nervous. Or <laughs> so there's someone behind me in line. I got nervous. Um, I got one lotion in their new fragrance, fragrance pink chiffon. And oh, I don't know. This just smells like kind of grapefruity to me. But it's real light and springy, and I really love it. Sometimes I wish that their like lotions and stuff had matching candles. Is that strange? Does anybody else have that desire? Because I have this car scent from last summer, Caribbean Escape, I think, and I wanted it in like a body splash. And when I went in and asked, the lady looked at me like I was straight crazy. Anyway, so I got... Ooh. Oh, here it is. I got the pink chiffon. So this is what the new packaging looks like. They're taller, and it's kind of a clear-ish container. So, pink chiffon. kind of looks like that. So, I got that to go with that lotion. I have the shower gel and lotion for the Paris Amour. So, I got a body splash in it. That's what it looks like. Um, they have an acrylic lid now. Not the cheap plastic. This one has more of a like floral smell to it. It's very different from the pink chiffon. Okay, and then I got two new ones. I don't have matching lotions in these, but I felt that they smelled really good. Um, the first one is Forever Sunshine. I don't know that I'd ever smelled it before. I think the packaging on this one's my favorite. It goes from purple to yellow. And this one is kind of it reminds me of a perfume like maybe happy um clinic happy or something like that but it's probably my favorite that i bought and then the <coughs> and then the last one i got is rays of citrus and i think this one's new and it looks like this and it it has like a It's a very light scent. It's very light and kind of um, tart. Um, but I liked it for, you know, like um, right after I get out of the shower at night or something like that. So that's what I got from Bath and Body Works. Like I said, please don't judge me. Or do. But I like Body Splash and I wanted to try out their new ones. So, okay, and then before that, I went to Lush because I needed soap. So, I don't know why I ended up with this gigantic bag full of crap when all I needed was soap. Well, let me show you what I got. Okay, I don't even really remember. Oh, so honestly, I bought this because I thought that it was really pretty. This is um, Phoenix Rising, I think is what it's called, and it's a bath bomb. And it says it's supposed to smell like apple spice. 
And now that I'm home, I can smell, smell that, but look how pretty it is. Isn't that just super pretty? Super pretty. And it leaves like a gold dust on your fingers that I just want to like rub all over my flesh. That's probably strange. Okay. And then I got, the girl talked me into so much. She was like, you want it? And I'm like, oh yeah. Um, whatever this thing is, I don't, <laughs> do you like, I don't even know what it is. Let me look at my receipt and see if it says. Oh, this is Floating Island. And I'm going to probably try to like break it and use it for a couple of baths. I kind of got talked into that one. I don't know that I wanted that one. Um, okay. This is called Space Girl Ballistic. It's a bath bomb. The other one was a melt. This is a bomb. It looks like a Saturn? Is that what that is? I don't know what its scent is. It's kind of like a, like it kind of hits you. So, I've never used it before. Um, then I got a bubble room. Is that what this is called? A bubble room. I got the orange one. This one I love how it smells. I don't know what the smell on this is, um, but I love it. It reminds me of kind of the porridge soap. So these you can break. And they got ooey gooey in them. But hopefully, um, I wonder if I could break that in four. I don't have a very big bathtub. And so if I'm going to cocktail some of this stuff, which I'm going to. Um, and I ended up not getting one of my favorite ones. Okay, so I was debating on if I wanted to get this. And I waited too late to go run my errands to go by the beauty supply and I needed it. So I ended up getting it at Lush. But, um, I probably won't ever get it again, even if I love it, because, I don't know. So, I got the Daddy-O, which is the purple shampoo. And, um, I don't know if you know, purple shampoo fights brassiness. So, if you are a natural blonde or, um, have blonde highlights, it does not matter. Um, the purple will help to pull out any yellow or orange. Um, that's for real what happens and then what I actually went in there for was soap and this is porridge it is my favorite I go in there every single time I need something and I smell all of the soaps and I smell porridge probably it's like the first one I smell and the last one I smell and the one I smell in between other smells and um did not get a whole pound of it. I only got 0.85 of a pound. So that's what I got. And it is exfoliating. It's got little oats in it. Um, which get all over my shower and make my husband crazy. Um, but you can see, I don't know if you can tell, it's super creamy. But it does have the oats in it. Oh, it's my favorite, favorite Lush thing ever. I just want to eat it but you shouldn't so anyway I will probably cut this into I like to leave my chunks bigger especially of this one because I feel like once they get to like a slivery size they kind of crumble and fall apart this particular one so like I will probably cut this just in half um, I may do thirds but I doubt it. I will probably, I might even leave it as one big job. Sorry. Anyway, so that's my haul. Um, I spent way too much money today. That's the moral of this story. And so you may not see a haul for the rest of the month because I spent all of my haul money in one shebang. My bad. Bye.